Splash, Simba, Hydrox, and Boo. The Lucky Ferals. It is 9.15 a.m. And I was just outside about five minutes ago. And I refilled the big stainless steel water bowl because I think the... Um, I think the raccoons emptied it last night. I heard a lot of like animal activity outside and at one point I looked outside and it was the mother raccoon with the two babies. Um, then I heard like metal clanging so I, I was pretty sure it was the water bowl and sure enough it was. So I refilled it today and as I did that I noticed that Hydrax was sleeping on one of the patio chairs and Ditto was all curled up on the side of the house. It's nice and cool out today. It's like 68 degrees, 70 degrees right now. So this is the first like cool morning, cool overnight that we've had. It's been super uh, warm. And I'm just about to bring them both some food. So they're gonna split a can of the four health um, turkey and giblets. And if they eat that, then I'll give them more. There's plenty of dry food in the feeder. So, um, so that's good. And I'm 100% positive Ditto is a boy. 100%. And with Hydrox, I just saw his backside and... I mean, Hydrox looks like a girl. Hydrox's backside looks like a girl to me. So, um... Yeah, that would, that would be really interesting. So, I'm going to feed them. So they're both eating their food, and with these two it's a lot about positioning. Like Hydrox, that was originally Ditto's plate, and then Hydrox took it, and then I put this down for Ditto, and then he'll eat it here. Hello, Ditto. How are you? You gotta eat some food, Ditto, okay? Eat your food, Ditto. I don't know if that's thunder I hear or a plane. Might be a plane. Eat your food, Ditto, okay? Ditto, eat your food. There's dry food in the feeder. You could eat that too, okay? Okay. You okay? Give me a pet. Give me a pet. So I'm not going to pet Ditto from the front because, you know, with the feral cat. You gotta be careful, they will swat at you. He does appear to want to be friendly because he's rubbing up on everything. And he's letting me close to him. His tail is in the air. His ears are not back. He seems curious, but again, I don't want to push myself on him. Okay, ditto. Okay, Ditto. Can I have a pet? Remember, feral cats, a lot of them don't even know what petting is because they've never been pet before. But the fact that he's rolling around like that is a really good sign. That's what Boo used to do. That's what Stella used to do. It means that they trust you and they like you. Hydrox ate a good amount of his food. I was sitting at the table getting some work done and I kept hearing like a cat. You know like when a cat is sleeping and dreaming and they make like little noises? That's what I kept hearing. I'm like, where's it coming from? This is where it's coming from. Look, Simba's sleeping in this tent bed. He's so cute. He's so comfy in there. Hey, yeah, Boo is hanging out on the bed. How you doing, Boo? You comfy? Boo says he's taking a nice nap. It is 1.44 p.m. 
and Hydrox and Ditto were having lunch today. So what happened was I went outside to clear some stuff off the lawn in the front of the house and I saw Ditto hanging out by the side of the house again. He has a new spot that he likes to lay over there. So I was talking to him and then I was like, Ditto, you want some treats? I thought I'd give him some dried sardines. Uh, so he came onto the patio and I gave him some dried sardines, but he didn't want any. I guess he doesn't know what they are. And then Hydrox showed up and the two of them were meowing at each other. So I was like, okay guys, you want lunch? So I have, so I am going to sit here for a little while and catch up with some reading. And we'll see what Ditto does. Is, Dit is Ditto just going to hang out here? And there's Hydrox. Hydrox's fur looks much better. Like it's definitely been growing in. Hello, Ditto. Look what's going on here. He just did that on the grass. Like on the grass. Like how are you gonna bury that ditto? There's plenty of dirt all around and he had to do that on the grass. It's probably marking territory, although he is burying it. Hopefully it was just pee and not poop. It is 8.20 p.m. and Hydrox was by the back door so I just gave him some food. And I went outside and I looked for Ditto and I did not see Ditto anywhere. And there's Ditto right now so I'm going to put some more food out for Ditto. I just wish these cats would like hang out together so it would just be more convenient for me to put all the food out at the same time. It's 8 a.m. That's cat litter on the green mat. And there's a litter box in this uh, black cabinet. I've been wondering why there's so much cat litter on this mat. Sim has been playing with it. Simba, what are you doing? What are you doing? You okay? You feel okay? Here's Splash. So today the garbage trucks pick up garbage and the recycling trucks pick up recycling so the cats get a little bit anxious when they hear all the truck noises outside. Here's Boo, he's hanging out on top of the cat tower.
Hello, Stella. You're a pretty girl. I'm pretty. There are now three cats on the bed and one cat in the cat tower.
it is 6 26 p.m and i just opened the back door because i really want to go for a bike ride but there's hydrax and ditto so i'm going to give them some food now So Hydrox is now using this watermelon mat as a scratching post. That's fine. Um, we saw Ditto just doing like a lot of coughing and stuff. And that is normally a symptom of a lot of mucus in his system. Whenever you have any kind of respiratory tract infection, anytime you're coughing, sneezing, uh, stuff like that, that is all lymphatic congestion. It's lymphatic congestion in the respiratory tract in the sinuses, um, basically in the entire lymphatic system. Um, and that is brought about by diet. Uh, it's brought about by what you eat, what you drink, um, and also lifestyle, how much stress you're, you're in, um, what you're breathing, um, what you're putting on your skin topically. So for a cat, it's normally what they're eating, what they're drinking, and what they're breathing. Also, lifestyle if they are stressed out. Now again, uh, Ditto lives outside. I don't know what he's eating. I don't know what other people are feeding him. Um, there's all kinds of cat food on the market with cheese in it. You want to give your cat a respiratory tract infection. You want to give him sinus problems. You want to give him like ear infections. Give him cheese. Uh, it's like the worst thing. So... All I could do for Ditto is, you know, give him the healthiest food I can and put some herbs in there to try to help get rid of that congestion. I was just brushing Ditto. I was brushing his back and he was really enjoying it, but then I tried to brush the back of his head and it freaked him out. So then I just went inside to get the camera and um, I give them both food. I give them food that they like, but they're not eating. I don't know if they're gonna wait till I go inside. Ditto. Wanna be brushed? Want to be brushed? I can brush you. You liked it on your back? See, what he was doing was he was raising his back to meet the brush. Okay, you gonna eat? I'll try one more time. Okay. Here, come here. Come here. Ditto. Your name is Ditto. Come here, Ditto. And then I brush your back. I brush your back. I know, you're very happy. I know you like me. He's been stretching, and he's been rolling. And when you see a cat rolling like that, when you see a cat stretching, it means they like you. Let's see. He just, he just needs to get used to how it feels. You're okay. You, you liked it before. The problem is, might be that I'm using the new camera, which is much bigger, because I also have it on a little tripod. There we go. There we go, Ditto. You like it? I think he's getting annoyed with it. Yeah. But not too annoyed with it. His tail is in the air. Here. Want it? So he hasn't run away, totally. Okay. Okay. That's food from breakfast. No one, no one finished it. His tail is still in the air. He's still here. He's rolling around, so... It will take him a while to get used to it. But just today, he's made really good progress. 
Can you eat some food, please? Ten. I brush some ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Brushed him 15 times, not counting the ones before. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. See, that was a little bit better. He still freaked out, but he didn't like run like he did last time. Okay. Okay, little baby. Okay. Ooh, nice. Nice, ditto. Okay, I don't want to freak him out too much, so. Hydrox has been watching. Hydrox, you gonna let me brush you? Brush Hydrox? <laughs> let me brush Hydrox? No. Good boy, Ditto. Good boy. Now eat your food. Eat your food, Ditto. Are you gonna... <laughs> okay, alright. That's good. It's good progress for a day. I don't wanna... I don't wanna freak him out too much. Okay, Ditto. Okay. You're a nice boy, Ditto. You're a nice boy. Hello. Hello. Thank you for watching this Lucky Farrells video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you'd like me to post more videos, and please make sure to check out these other videos that were selected especially for you.